Through Wellness. Great to see you guys today. This month I want to talk about child's health. Keeping our kiddos healthy is really important, um, especially if you have multiple kids at home and eliminating the domino effect of when someone gets sick. So today I wanna to talk about the kapha characteristic and excess kapha as it will show up in your child. Kapha time of life is between the ages of zero and 18. So this is the time that we are building, that we're growing, that um, we are nourishing our bodies. There's a lot of more heavy, sticky qualities about us, hence the excess mucus and snot that is constantly dripping down most kids' noses. And we can do a few things to help excess mucus if they're constantly having rattling in their chest or stuffed up sinuses. Um, this can be a breeding ground for germs and then we're constantly fighting this battle of bringing home the cold and the flu and the whole family getting it. So what we can do is look at our child's tongue, see if there's excess coating, if there's like a white thick coating on the child's tongue, um, that usually means that there's too much mucus going on for the body to healthily be able to deal with. And if there's too much up in the upper body, that usually means that there's too much mucus in the gut. And too much mucus in the gut will slow down digestion, and then there won't be proper digestive enzymes and stomach acid, which will lead to the compromise of digestion, absorption, um, so malnutrition will be happening because the child isn't able to break down the food properly. There's a great herb though that you can use to help break up this mucus, and it also helps to strengthen the upper respiratory system, which is wonderful as well. So the herb is called Trichotu. It is a mix of ginger, pipoli, and black pepper. And what you can do, you can buy it in capsule form, depending on the age of your child, or in powder form. Um, after or before two meals, um, so before lunch and dinner, I would suggest taking one to two capsules, um, having your child take one to two capsules of the Trichotu, and this will help with digestion. Or you can mix equal parts Trichotu with raw honey, and before each meal, taking about a half a teaspoon of that mixture. It should go down pretty easily. And um, this will just really help with um, creating some of that heat, and then honey helps to liquefy mucus so that the body can get rid of it properly. You can also cook more with ginger, black pepper, um, hing, these things, these heating spices um, to just aid in digestion so that your child um, can have a little bit of help. Also, the Trichotu can be really good for you if you're just on this um, kick of having a little bit of later dinners and maybe you're not having a lot of time to cook so your child is eating more pizza, more um, cheese, macaroni and cheese, uh, these heavier qualities and you're noticing that no matter what child um, dosha they are, whether they're vata pitta kapha, they're starting to get more mucusy. just give them that for a couple of days and that'll help to break it down. So I hope that this is really helpful. I will link to Trichotu um, at below this posting. And uh, if you have any questions, please let me know. Tune in next week for more child care. And um, I look forward to seeing you then. Have a lovely day. Namaste.